I'm gonna make this real easy. Lift weights. It's not a complicated process. I think sometimes we try to make it too complicated, but at the end of the day, it's moving heavy stuff. What you're looking to do is you're trying to create overload over time. You're trying to do a little more than you did before to challenge the muscle to try to get bigger and stronger. The whole idea is when we work out, we tear things down. The muscle gets torn down so that it has to repair. So what we do is we heal to get stronger and faster and better. Now, does that mean that you have to be in the gym six and seven days a week, multiple times a day? No, three, four, five days will more than do it for most people. But I think it's important to be consistent with it, keep it up over time, and try not to have these ups and downs where you do it for a while and then you back off and then you do it for a while. Consistency's king sticking to sort of the traditional lifts like bench press and squats and deadlifts and shoulder presses, those all still work. And it even looks like splitting it up between upper body and lower body days works incredibly well. With most of the people that we work with in my lab and a lot of the athletes that we also interact with and train, we actually emphasize an upper body and a lower body day. That allows us to do more of a push and a pull type of program. And I do encourage people to play around with the organization and order of their workouts a little bit to see what fits your needs. It's just important that you train hard when you're doing it and you will get results.